I'm currently at 713. Haven't made too much progress on the ELO lately. But let's play a game and see if we can make some progress. So I'm expecting some cheese ball stuff here with his queen. So what I'll do is I'm fully expecting him to put his queen here. So this is a trap. So we'll probably go here. I'm surprised he didn't do that. Um, I'll put my knight out so I can just develop really fast. The knight's defended, so I'll castle. Okay. Um, let's see. So if I go there, there. No, I can't move that. I'll defend my knight. Try to kick his bishop out. Okay. I think I'm going to go for the attack on his queen. He can have my bishop if he wants. I can just recapture it. Or I can't. Trade. He's already up. Let's see, if he goes here, I take... might check me here. Fine. I'm mostly just looking for this fork so I can be oh and he he spotted that. So that's good. Good on his part. I'll go for the kick here. Go for the trade there. I'll just give him the stack pawns. So let's see, take, 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 take. I'll offer the trade here. to keep that pawn protected. Put that on a dark square. I let him take it, it's going to be, maybe I just protect it with a pawn. I think I'll just protect it with a pawn. Maybe I push here. I think this is okay because now I can, oh really? I'm going to go for the trade. I'll trade. I know he's up one piece, but... I think I'll just try to move his bishop around a little bit. Um, I want to start attacking with the king. I see, so he'll take my on here. So I'll go defend it. Uh, 
That's a bit of an attack. Um, if he takes my pawn, I'll just go here and give him check. Okay. Attack his bishop. Okay. Don't want to attack that. Maybe I just push up his king side. I'm going to block his pawn from advancing. Only move there. Okay, that was expected. I can't give him check here. Maybe he'll take with the rook. Oh. This is probably lost. I think he's just too far up ahead. Uh, I'll try to push my pawn while I can. I'm um, sure I'll give him the trade here. I have a pawn further up the board. I'll try to go snag his. Hmm. Uh, he should push his pawn, I think. Yeah, this is probably lost. He'll probably just take. Uh, yeah, this is GG. He'll just get a queen here. That's like an 04 here is stalemate. Let's see if I can get a stalemate going at least. This is definitely resignable, but I'd like to get a draw if possible. Oh, really? Interesting. Now we do the ladder, and that'll probably be GG. Ah, nice, GG. Yeah, it was a tough one, from my perspective at least. Looks like we both played pretty well. But he just had the advantage the whole game. So it looks like I just had one blunder. So this position here just kind of ruined everything for me. I should have just moved the bishop back. It's interesting. So this one move just gave him the advantage the whole game. So moving the bishop back here was the play. Oh, I see. So if he were to jump his knight onto f6, I could just recapture. Then if his queen took, my queen could take. Interesting. Hmm. So really my mistake here was I didn't account for the fact that he had two attackers on f6, and I really only had one defender. And I was focused on trying to balance the position out by going for this fork on c2 here. But really what I should have done was just focused on getting the bishop out to a safe square where it couldn't be harmed. Interesting. Hmm. Yes, yeah, so that basically threw the whole game. Well, that was a fun one. The, um, the opponent played some opening there that I wasn't super familiar with, and I wasn't really 
entirely sure. I know he was going for cheese ball stuff. Um, but I just couldn't remember what the right response to this was. So it looks like the end if he goes to f3, the engine wants me to go to queen e7. Okay. Good to know. Maybe castling wasn't the play there either. Maybe I should have castled the other way. But oh well. Good game by my opponent. Um, I think I'll do one more today.